and I... I had to be cheap there, because Liu Kang was pissing me off there, I'm not going to lie. Hello, thank you for coming back to the channel. Back on Mortal Kombat X today, because I've noticed Mortal Kombat on their premier towers keep putting really, really cool towers out. Now, today is the Mortal Kombat 4 tower. But this is the middle of my alien theme week on YouTube. So, I'm going to be taking on the characters who featured in Mortal Kombat 4 with the Xenomorph. That sounds the most ridiculous thing. And before you say anything, yes, I know, I say I don't normally like guest characters. But we're celebrating the Xenomorph at the moment. All things Xenomorph, all things alien, because of the 35th anniversary of Alien coming out. Alien. So, of course, this is Mortal Kombat. 10 or X, so there's three variations you can have. I mean, Acidic is normally one I go for because it has the acid blood, acid spray. Conjurer is a bit of a weird one, it gets the um, face huggers coming out of eggs and stuff. But I've been playing around with Takartan, and this is basically got Baraka's, some of Baraka's moveset, but you're a xenomorph, so what's not to love? So let's give it a go. Let's give it a go. Now, obviously, the Xenomorph is not normally one of my mains, so this is going to be a bit of a, well, bit of a challenge, let's say. But, you know, I like giving myself a challenge. I like pushing myself to, to see if I can do something different each time. Tarkatan. Yeah, that's a Tarkatan raid, yeah, of course it is. Is that, is that your answer? Round one. Now, Fight. The thing is with Mortal Kombat 4, that is by far my least played Mortal Kombat. It's in fact it's the only Mortal Kombat game I don't actually own. So, oh shit. So, I mean, I did some warm ups with the Xenomorph, and Jesus Christ. He, he's, got, he's got real good range with his, with his tail. But it's also, if you notice, Baraka's sort of play frenzy. That, that I rate. I rate that. I like that a lot. He's got Takata and Rush attack, which... I refuse to believe that's it. I mean, in practice earlier, I was putting on some really good combos, and now that the camera's on, I'm failing to do so. Which is always the way. Every... And the thing is, yeah, Alien doesn't have a, uh, doesn't seem to have a uh, projectile, which is a bit, a bit of a tricky one. But how's that for combo? Brutality. Or brutality. Alien that was, um, win. that was done by accident, to <laughs> be perfectly honest. But that is pretty cool. That is pretty cool. And i got some rewards. got some Xenomorph-based rewards. How charming. Yeah, he's not a bad character. I will say Tanya. Tanya's a good character. I like I like Tanya. Again, I wish she was brought in Mortal Kombat 11. But, hey, you can't have everyone in Mortal Kombat 11. That's something I need to tell myself. But yeah, no, Tanya's a really handy character. I, I'm starting to think I should have done the flipping Mortal Kombat 4 tower with Tanya. Round one. Fight. But no, I've, uh, I'm committed to the, the Xenomorph. Ugh. All over. Ah, oh, damn it. Oh yeah, he's got that, that tail flip. That's a really cool flip to move. Top bottom in the corner. Which means you can corner juggle them from that from that sort of blade frenzy into an uppercut. And that does tons of damage. Like so. Oh, except I just missed. And he's got a really and he's got that move where you just basically just change position with them with that low crawl. It's just re it's just really handy getting out of tight situations, he says. Actually yeah, what's the x-ray like? Looking savage is the answer. Oh my. Well. Finish her. 
this isn't really much of a fatality, and you know, a die-hard alien fan will pick apart this fatality because surely it's the alien queen's uh, best interest to keep you alive to incubate the um for a face I'm going to incubate. But no, as it happens, the queen has torn her in half. But I must admit, I am having a lot of fun. Playing as the Xeno here, if I'm perfectly honest. A lot of fun. Torn always tells me all the time the Xeno's a really good character in Mortal Kombat X, and I, you know, I'm stuck in my ways. I'm not a huge fan of guest characters. I'm like, oh, they don't belong in Mortal Kombat. And then, obviously, when I'm doing this series of alien themed games, you almost look round one. It's actually Fight. kind of a cool thing that the Xeno is in this. Oh, no. I thought he was going to hit me with this. Oh, I just noticed reptiles in his sort of ninja outfit, which I, I rate that. You know what? I really like Mortal Kombat. I need to play it more because I'm just so so hell bent on just playing Mortal Kombat 11 that I just kind of miss out. I mean, sure, the comboing isn't as fluid as 11, but it's still pretty bloody good. Round two, fight. Oh, you little plastic on the little cooking combo breakers, which drive me absolutely freaking potty, but. Actually, I can um, amplify that, can't I? Can't I? Or just get hit by a force ball instead, because I'm an idiot. Okay, I'm trying to. Stop trying to work out if I can amplify that move or not. Oh shit! Gotcha. Uh, it's that, 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 that. Yeah, we go. Also, in this variation, is that pretty freaking cool? Alien. Because the um. I think it's the acidic one. It's got like a really the classic shiny head. Was this one? It's kind of it's more savage, isn't it? It's more savage, better looking. Oh, cool him as well. Look at that. How's that feeling? How's, sorry, it's put in hard smooth in this, isn't it? Oh, I thought I read the help book there. Oh shit. Okay. This is a stage fatality, isn't it? No, apparently not. <laughs> this is an interesting thing. This is, this is just the standard victory for the um, Xenor. That's basically a fatality. <laughs> its standard victory stance is pretty much a fatality. I haven't worked out if that's cool or not. I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm going with that's cool. I'm gonna stick with. That's actually pretty awesome, you know, in, in Mortal Kombat. Right. Not... I mean, look at the range of that. That's flipping awesome. And I got caught. All over. No, you don't. I saw that. Been a brutality. Fine. Fine. I will say, this version of Jax, way better than Mortal Kombat 11 Jax. By far. I just don't like Mortal Kombat 11 Jax at all. This, this version of Jax isn't wins. That's so offensive to me, but but the 11 one, no, I'm not a fan. Same way that the MKX version of Cassie Cage, I much prefer it to the 11 one. Although the 11 one is growing on me a little bit. 
Stay in that corner. You little fuck. Seriously, I was just seriously, I was just doing so many cool. Oh, I actually blocked it. Bitch. So the alien queen is terrible. Really is. Alien wins. Fatality. It does annoy me actually that this is OCD on my part. That the fact they call it alien and not xenomorph. I'd much prefer it be called xenomorph. It's game over, man. <laughs> oh, so that's a nice Round touch. Thank you, Hudson. All over. I do, I do miss having a character without a projection because they just it just adds that extra layer of keeping him at bay. You know what I mean? Especially when he can just sit there and. Yes. Look at that. I mean, I'm not really a Baraka player either. That's the thing. I mean, I'll, again, Baraka, character I really like. Wouldn't say I'm, Oh, frick. That was stupid. Didn't actually mean to do that. Caught him with an X-ray. Right People always say it to me, especially when I stream uh, about X, you go, X-ray moves and, well, fatal blows. That would be enough to kill you. That would kill you, let's be honest, that would kill you. Okay. Got a shot of that. Is it pulled away? There we go. It's hold towards, that's why, during the final hit. Alien wins. Oh, Zena brutality. In fact, those are the only two I've seen. I am aware of a, a third one on this particular variation, but... Whether I'll pull it off is another matter. One sheep. Nice. Uh, round two. Fight. <laughs> there you go. Something you never thought you'd see. A xenomorph using a Roman shield. Oh. Fuck, I say, uh... Okay, he's not fucking around now, is he? Oh! That was a flipping clutch, wasn't it? My god. Stressful, very quickly. Alien wins. Fatality. All over. This is where you fall that. Okay, that was absolutely hit. Box. Quickly. And I. 
I had to be cheap there because Liu Kang was pissing me off there, I'm not going to lie. I love it, and you know me, I love a brutality. Right, Shinnok, is this normal Shinnok or is this take the piss giant flaming Shinnok? Let's find out. And will he have his weird bony hands? I will say, actually, no, actually, this variation of Shinnok does look quite cool. So let's jump. Oh, fuck me, that move pisses me off so much. Oh, and he walked, got up straight into it. That was good for me. Oh, that rush. Love it. What? That missed? Oh, no, it caught me in a juggle. Good. You big fucking Sally. Come here. Okay, this has got sweaty. Well, I've now got officially sweaty, but in my defense, Xeno's not one of my mains. I've never really played it until I decided to do this ridiculous experiment with video. Oh. oh! And that is the other brutality I couldn't do. That is the first time I've done it, and I've ripped his legs off. Ha! Well, how's that for a finish? That is not a bad finish. And I've got a little Mortal Kombat 4 little uh, symbol. Brilliant. Well, that was cool. I, I really enjoyed that. And even got gold. Even got gold. So, I'm chuffed with that. Five fatalities, four brutalities. Yep, I'll take that. Take that and no losses. Because, I mean, last time I tried a Mortal Kombat X Tower, I lost to uh, the Jade character. So, guys, that will be the Xenomorph... Um, in the Mortal Kombat 4 tower. Weird combination, I concur. Actually, yeah, that is really, really weird. I oh, look, it was it was me celebrating Alien this week on YouTube, and I thought, let's do something really random. And I knew the Xenomorph was a character in Mortal Kombat X. So, guys, if you've come this far, thank you very much for choosing to spend your time with me. If you like this video, please drop a little like, and perhaps subscribe to the channel if you're new. So, it's nice going back to... Uh, Mortal Kombat X because it is actually a really good game. I do spend a extortionate amount of time in Mortal Kombat 11, so it is nice to actually do some of the other ones. So I'm just going to oh, friendly little reminder though. If you do like the way the haphazard way I do do beat ups, I do stream beat ups on Twitch. On I stream on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays, but it's the Tuesdays which I want to draw attention to because I always do a beat em up on a bruise day. So, again, if the haphazard way that I play beat em ups and the ridiculous commentary is to your taste, then please feel free to drop by. We'd love to see you and say hi. So, I'm going to leave this here and say, guys, thanks so, much, thanks so much for watching again. Stay safe, and I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye bye.